This episode is brought to you by our good friends at Squarespace. On this exciting episode of the Pixel Game Squad. For, what is it? For Shake it! Stop! Wait, did you buy this just for me? <laughs> oh, baby! Like 70 something? I'm trying to make a gamble on the box. Dragon's Lair? On the Nintendo Switch was there. So to find that was awesome. Thank you. For the love, love of money! Oh, boy. Ready. Oh, yeah. So I got to the swap meet today when it was super dark. I'm talking dark as it gets, and I'm looking around, I'm like, okay, I don't really want to look and hunt while it's dark. That's what I like to hear. Yeah. Called my name and everything. Special privileges. But then our homie literally says, riff, and he calls me over and on the table, boom. Clean SNES box. 1991 Super Nintendo, one of, not, not one of the best consoles of all time, the best console of all time. So that's the new Super Nintendo Entertainment System. What about it? They say it has 16-bit technology, whatever that means. He, he literally said, riff. And let's see, let's see though. So when he throws it on the table, I'm just looking at it, and I'm looking at Ricky, and I'm like, well, did you buy this just for me? <laughs> oh, baby. Oh, baby. Oh, we got a couple games in here too. I have to get it no matter what. They, all th they throw out a price that's like 300 bucks, which actually, they kind of do go for that price, and this one in that condition is beautiful, and I would say worth it. There's some, all right, how much for it? 200. Three. All right, let's see, what do we have though? I have to see what's all in here. We got the Super, we got some controllers, no cables, but you do have some good games as well. Dunk Dunk Country 2, Pack Attack, but then there's a bunch of games in there. And the good games, the games you want to see, the games you want on the Super Nintendo. I'd say all the games you want to play. All-Stars and Super Mario World. Let's see, look, one manual. There's one manual in here with it. And then, what is, I feel like I know, what is this? I never see this thing. Oh, what the, why does the poster look so much bigger than I'm used to seeing? So I threw out an offer of a counter of I think 250, and then I asked to throw in some Gremlins plates I got. They ended up accepting. Totally worth it. Super Nintendo, the GOAT. Yep. All right, I did it. I got it. Oh, I'll put it in my cart. Oh, yeah, I don't need a bag. Thank you, though. Thank you. Thing. The greatest of all time. Gabo, is the, is the Super Nintendo the greatest console of all time? Maybe. So sexy, so sexy, so sexy. Good condition box. Ricky noticed that the colors are actually a very vibrant color. I always enjoy these on it. It's not a, a sicker sticker, but it is cool. You know, I don't think in my entire life I've ever noticed the Nintendo Power branding on the back of some of the boxes. Did you? No, this might be a different box. <gasps> More rare, run! I'm just kidding. <laughs> Thank you, appreciate it. Thank you. What do you say is better? Huh? huh? Uh, 360, in my opinion. <laughs> I mean, I love the 360, but I would love nah, but <laughs> Yeah, Super NES is over there. All right, so we go to this booth, and we know the booth is from last week. We found Masters of the Universe sketches, and I found like all the animation stuff. And as I get there, I see it on the table, in the back, kind of stuffed away. I see a little Warner Bros. little symbol, and I'm telling you, I see a little sketch. And guess who it is? Superman. And then I look a little bit further. I find Quest of Camelot animation cell with background. And I'm just like, how do I keep doing that where I'm finding the things I love, which is paper? Hey, hey, where, where are you going? To save Camelot. Camelot? The restaurants, the theaters. The waitresses, the actresses. What about that Resident Evil toy? Oh, dude, I found some toys. That Resident Evil toy, I'm going to tell you right now, Gabo and Ricky were jealous. Yeah, they were both like, oh, oh no, did you see what he saw? <laughs> yeah, I oh. uh, do. One, one, oh. one of the crazier days again. Yeah. Hey, Gabo, why didn't you find the Resident Evil toy, bro? Yeah, see, there's a I don't, I, the I don't have the eye of the tiger. Yeah, the looks eye. like, looks like I did go back to be the rookie. Now he's taking oh, my spot. The rookie. Ricky, yeah. Show me what you got at All the right. booth. So what I got were these cars promo stand-ups for. For, what is it for? Shake it up. Shake it up. Shake it up. I'm sorry, I'm really bad at singing. But I got this gizmo, which is, I can't say no to gizmo. I got me some, this is just case only, but the game actually goes for like, how much Gabo, like 80? 
like 70 something. Then I got this young blood. I guess it's actually a limited edition CD. What else did I get? And I got, I got, I, I, I got. All right, so I, I really like old school Mickey, so I went, I went for it. I went for all three of these. I went for some Beauty and the Beast. Wow, did I even get any gaming items? The yeah, Intelligent Cube case. Oh yeah, I did, cool. You definitely I'm need good. to grow on intelligence then. Really. <laughs> <laughs> But at least I found something, you know? I found this VHS. Yes. Uh, Lakers socks, by the way. But it was all listed out online. Uh, it was at least like 80 bucks, something like that, but whatever, five yeah. bucks. I can't believe it. At this booth with our amazing friend, by the way, I'm just finding stuff. We're all finding stuff. It's unreal that we're all finding stuff. But I'm seeing more Sid Haig stuff. And the more and more I find the Sid, Sid Haig stuff, the more I'm getting like attached to who he is and what he did for the horror scene and the horror community. I find Scream 3 press kits, super cool. But one of the coolest things I find is this disc and it's Sid Haig's Windows 95 like promo for like, hey, I'm an actor, hey, I'm a director, maybe you wanna hire me, maybe I need some some work if you wanna hire me, I'm not, not really super popular yet. This is crazy, this is the old way they would market different people back in the days. You got to do what you had to do. You use MySpace, you use random CDs, you use floppy disks to send out what you do. So to find that was awesome. You have some top secret clown business that supersedes any plans that you might have for this here vehicle. <laughs> <laughs> Yo! Dude. Yo! If anybody sick. watching, if anybody watching doesn't know, who likes the Wii more? Who likes the Wii more? I'd say probably Ricky's a big. I am the Wii guy. guy. Let's go! Did you see this? What he gave me? Do you know what this is from? I do not. Home Alone. Oh, that's right. Pizza, Damn, that's pizza, sick. Pizza. <laughs> well, you have to pay for your pizza, sir. You found it. Huh? You found it. What? This? <laughs> he said he has something for me, and that's, you know, pretty standard with Dusty. Dusty, dream me. Dusty! Everything, everything's done. Everything's done. Uh -huh. All the stuff's done. And here, look who the culprits are blocking my deals. Hey, look, it's competition. Blocking. <laughs> look at that cute little doggy right here, though. He's a boo boo boo. Ooh, Iron Man. Look at that. I just saw that in the corner of the table. Atari. It's going to be a rare one. Burger Time. Space Hawk. Major League Basketball. Uh, ooh, Dungeons and Dragons. It's actually a decent one. I think Burgundy sounds good, right? Uh, Space Armada, Star Strike, Carnival Auto Racing. The good thing about Dusty is no matter what I do, he's nice to me, so I'm just gonna put these in my pocket. How much do I owe you? No! Look at this. Broken plates, but look at this one. Oh, no! no. No, these are actually Maybe. mildly valuable too. Yeah, these ones are. That one back together. I think I will glue this. That's honestly, a pretty clean break. That one is. Dang! Sick. I might even just. Oh, this is uh, the baby Flintstones too. I was not expecting what just happened at Dusty's. Dusty, how dare you? Oh, broken, dude. Broken. Oh, Gabo. Ah uh, no! Look at this. Pokemon 2000, Burger King, uh, McDonald's, this is sports. What is that one, Gabo? Barbie. 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 This is more 2022. Ooh, Halloween ones, these are kind of cool. The rabbit makes history as kids vote to give him a bowl of delicious fruit flavored tricks. Ricks are finally mine. So, look at this, the breakfast special. Count Chocula right here. Freaking, what's their face? Cinnamon Toast Crunch Cook? What's his name? I always forget. Is this a Cinnamon Toast Crunch Cook? Uh, I can't remember. Yes. And then tricks. Tricks are for kids, but look at this. Fred Flintstone, but then you got the Trolls mashup Fred Flintstone. Let's go. That's cool. And then I grabbed this too. Uh, old uh, Batman and Robin pillow set, sheet set. So what am I doing? Why am I? I haven't even started looking at the stuff he brought yet. This is not going well. Well, in a, yes it is, in a bad way. I get to his booth and I'm like, okay, I'm looking through this stuff. And I have to admit, when I started looking through the stuff, in my mind, I was playing with like, all right, Dusty's waxing me. Like, this is gonna be a bunch of junk. So check this out. I don't, I don't even know where to start. Dusty was just like, there's a giant box. No, there's a bunch, dude. Oh, down here. All, all this. Goes all this? Oh, look at this. Here. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Right look at this, Curtis. 
Halo Reach box back hey, here. Hey, look, original Xbox okay, okay. in the box. So we got Fallout. Um, we got, I don't know what any of this is, little toys. It didn't seem like that good of stuff at first. It was like a lot of random consoles, a lot of, you know, Xboxes, Wii, stuff I don't care about. PS2 controller. PS2. Oh, this is great. Look at the Modern Warfare 2 oh, goggles. I Those like cool. splinters. Oh, you like them? You like them? What's up, bro? Hey, what's up? But the more and more me and Gabo started to dig, even with the camera off, so you guys are just going to see parts of it, I was like, oh, shoot. Oh, this is where I think the goggles go yeah. on that. There's good stuff in here. There's Game Boy Advances. There's Pokemon games. Uh, Assassin's Creed, Be a Legend, Xbox 360. I think there's a statue in here. Oh, oh that's sick. Yeah. How am I supposed to? There's games in here. I mean, look. Oh, look, Gabo. Good one. Oh, that's a good one. That's a good controller. Yep. 360 console. Oh, look. There you go. Game Boy Player. Oh, open. No. Game Boy Player though. That's There's good. a DS game over there. DS game in there. Hemo yeah. feature of OG. Well, how many more boxes are there? A lot of those games that we saw, there was like a whole case of cases for video games from PS2 to GameCube to Nintendo Switch. And Dusty's like, yeah, a lot of them are empty, which a lot of them were. So there's these giant boxes full of, I mean, some have games, some don't. Like this has games in it, so that's great. But like a lot of them are empty as well. I was gonna try to make him gamble on the box and then oh, see man. a sad face What'd at the end. What do you want end? for everything? That's the, Hold on, one more box, one more box. It's just hard because there's so much that I wouldn't know what to do with. But there's a lot of really good cases in there. A lot of manuals in there. Most they don't, are empty. They don't really want it though, PSPs, PS Vitas, PSP games, PSP Game Boy Advance SP with Pokemon Mystery Dungeon. There oh, we go, nice. actually. Um, oh, still has battery. It works? Yeah. It works! Battery. Who knew? It is alive! It's alive, it's alive. It's really, really alive. It's my thing in a wing. And even Gabo noticed, I, Dusty, I'm sorry, Dragon's Lair on the Nintendo Switch was there in there. There was so much Xbox stuff in there. Tons of it. Huh? Another $10 one. Cross your fingers, cross your fingers. Yes. Okay. Things are just showing up. Things are just showing up. For the, you forgot about the Vita. I said it, but I didn't. I, I thought the console, not the game. Oh yes, there was a Vita console in there. And a PSP console. The, for the love. The, the Halo uh, figures. All Halo toys. Halo toys. Oh, that's a good for your one. Just like oh, yeah. Oh, oh, oh. Okay. Ricky would like these a lot. Oh, yeah. Ricky would like these a lot. All the, the Pokemon goals. figures. The goggles. The Master System. Dude, the Amiibo. The trainer. Pokemon trainer. I bought it from him. Thanks me for it. What a miracle! He hasn't paid me yet. There you go. Okay. Thank you. For the love oh. of money. Getting a little uh, nervous here. There's a lot of stuff in there, a lot of good stuff. But the problem is the time for the organizer. Oh, an organizer. Ooh, with a couple of Sega Master System games. Okay, out look at the condition on that Outrun right there. Outrun is so good, by the way. Such a good game. Ooh, Thunderblade, beautiful game too, as well. Oh boy. He pulls out. A Sega Master System. Oh yeah, the master for the master. Oh my gosh. <laughs> so if you've watched the podcast or listened, you know Sega Master is my jam. Oh my gosh. Uh, I just, really? I, I played it so much. I, I really like when people talk about, you know, their nostalgic past. There's a really soft spot for me in the Master System. What's the favorite game? Your favorite game on that? Um, Fantasy Star. Uh, okay. The music on it, man. I, my brother, if he's listening, I know he listens. Actually, it's just it's it's one of those things. Like I said, I cry over nothing. That song almost makes me cry. Was that a port of the Fantasy Stars on Sega Genesis, or was it a completely different game? It was the first Fantasy Star. Oh, it was the first one. first Fantasy Star was on there. Fantasy Zone, Rastan, uh, Penguin Land, the built-in snail maze, Hang On, uh, Space Harrier. One of my favorite port or versions of it. So I've never actually held this one in my hands. I always see it at conventions but I've never popped into it before. The big box, the 3D glasses Sega Master System. You see Master System boxes here and there, still super uncommon. Rarely even see Master Systems out in the wild. Oh my, I'm actually very quiet right now, Curtis. 
because I don't feel like my brain is like not working. It's not computing. But I see it, the big box with the 3D glasses. It's even got the, the connectors for their 3D glasses. Wow, this is really clean. It's got the 3D glasses input adapter too. Oh, it has the 3D glasses. It has the 3D glasses. So close, clean. close it up and tell them it's all missing. Now, Sega challenges you to experience Sega Scope 3D. 3D so real it puts the action right in your face. Not even 3D effects like these can match what you'll see through these amazing Sega Scope 3D glasses. Games and accessories sold separately. It's in beautiful condition. This to me means so much. The Sega Master System to me is one of those consoles that far too many people don't play and don't care about. I feel like the love of Sega Master System nostalgia is so underplayed in the retro community. Even when I ask fellow retro collectors to this day, a lot of them are like, yeah, it's not for me, which I understand. So I'm thinking about doing it. I'm thinking just walking over to Dusty and being like a thousand bucks for everything. But if you go deep and you play some of the games on it, it's just such a beautiful console. I'm telling you, all we are saying is give the Master System a chance. I think the biggest problem with that lot is gonna be the time. I might legit like give my son 50 bucks and just tell him to clean everything, test everything, and just make it a night for me. All right, Dusty. Gabo, rate it. From F to worst, S the best. What is the Sega Master System? The Sega Master System used this controller. Oh, beep, 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 beep. What are we doing? What are we doing? I was gonna say 1200 for everything. I was gonna say 1000 for everything. Dang, dude. Give me 11. And I actually break even. I don't even make a dollar. 900 for the room, I paid 200 for that. <laughs> uh, Sega Master System, I rate it uh, C. Sega introduces America's Most Wanted, Wonder Boy 3, wanted for killing monsters and demons in his quest to lift the dragon's curse, wanted for its constantly changing adventure experience, California Games, wanted for its fun in the sun and surf, wanted because up to eight friends can compete in great outdoor summer sports, Wonder Boy 3, California Games, America's Most Wanted, from Sega, Master System and Games sold separately. Look at that guy. He's just looking. <laughs> Curtis, what do you think, bro? I think I'm in. I'm in. Oh, we're just in? <laughs> no, no. Come and do it after. Remember, let me finish it. <laughs> Dusty, I what's think up, I'm in, bro? I'm not even making that, bro. I'm just hooking you up. I'm using what do you that say to the do... audience who says you uh, ream me every time. I get reamed. I picked this up. I paid for labor, and I break even. Hey, Dusty. <laughs> it is what it is. <laughs> it's all right, though. <laughs> My friend. I will nail you later. Ooh, hey. So I'm came here to my car to load up all of these. Curtis is gonna help me with his car because I don't have room. And then we're gonna go back out and hunt more. I don't even know if I want to hunt more necessarily because this is by far the biggest purchase, not even financially yet. Surprisingly, this might be one of the best deals Dusty gave me. The more and more I'm diving into this stuff, the more I'm like, oh shoot, that was actually pretty good. We keep finding cheap. stuff. We keep finding, I just found like a bag of Vita games. So just, oh, I will want some of those, thank you. But uh, I gotta load up my car, then go back out, but we'll see. Dude wipes, <laughs> for your man. Check it out, single stitch, size large right here. Freaking Batman Forever. Look at that. Beautiful single stitch right there. Actually, the color on this is really clean. He wants 40 bucks. I think I'll hook him up with Sorry to bucks. interrupt. Yes, what? I just find out something really cool. What would you find so out? So, this is Batman Forever movie? Yes. But, yes, promo. 1994, because the movie came out in 1995. Can I persuade you to take a sandwich with you, sir? I'll get drive through. What is this? It's a, you like it. You dude. know what is so funny? I bought this on Whatnot last night. Really? <laughs> last night, I literally won How this much? on what? Like 15, 20 bucks. They were just running. Yeah. Totally. This is a good one, though. Oh. Look at the way this guy's hunting right here. Curtis is lifting up. <laughs> it's low key raining right yeah, now, it is, too, dude. by the way. Dude, this is from. The little, what is it, monsters? Little monsters? I'm just gonna let you sound no, dumb. No, 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 it is little monsters. I'm pretty sure. Hey, stop! <laughs> Curtis. Poop at me. Why aren't we at the swap meet anymore? Dude, it's raining. It was raining. Dude, it's, like, it's a bummer. It doesn't feel as bad right now, but a lot of the vendors were covering up their stuff. Yeah, yeah, I think one of the one thing is like, you, you kind of get a little bit bummed out when you see the things start to get soggy. And yeah. you're like, no. 
Uh, it's just not the fun thing to be out in the in the rain. So. Gabo, what's your favorite thing you bought today? Uh, to be honest, the amiibo that I bought from you. Oh, he bought one of the amiibos that I sold. And, and of course, the trash bags. What you? <laughs> Just so everyone knows, in my house looks like an absolute mess now. Curtis and I have been going at this for <laughs> two hours at least. Oh yeah! Two hours. <laughs> Look at that. That random Fallout figure was worth 60 bucks. Uh, that cape controller is worth money. Look at this, Dusty. You see that, baby? Eat that one. 120. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, and but then again, but then again. Taking a pause once again to say thank you to one of our longest running sponsors, Squarespace, a beautiful platform on which to create your websites. One of the best features about Squarespace is the custom merch. Easily sell custom merch and create a passive income stream that engages your audience and scales your brand. Design your products and production and inventory. And get this, shipping is handled for you, saving you time, money, and effort. Oh, and you know time is valuable. Also, Squarespace extensions. With Squarespace extensions, you you can connect your store to vetted third-party tools to extend the functionality of your website. Ooh, and member areas. Monetize your content by selling membership access to exclusive sections of your website. Okay, I, I like that a lot. Go to squarespace.com for a free trial, and when you're ready to launch, go to squarespace.com slash pixel game squad to save 10% off your first purchase of a website or domain. These were all empty. Empty cases, a full box, all this stuff, just tons and tons and tons of stuff. Uh, worth it for sure. Value-wise, we have to put the time in it. Exactly. Let me do it! Gosh dang it! <laughs> I'm not that big into uh, balls. I'm gonna give it to a uh, Laker fan, true Laker fan that is not Mikey. Do you like the Lakers? No, but <laughs> okay. it's okay. okay. Oh my god. Congratulations, Dusty is a father now. Oh yeah. A father. Congratulations, for real. I mean, that. that's actually very cool. As a dad, it's the coolest thing in the Look world. Look at this. That's Look a at this proud thing. dad. That is a that, proud dad. I love that. Oh, you like beautiful. my wallpaper? Yeah. That is beautiful. That's your I baby? Yeah. Just oh, congratulations, man. Yeah. <laughs> the price just went down. <laughs> this is a uh, Ninja Turtle Pokemon. No, I don't sleep with the dog. <laughs> <laughs> Something about sleeping with a dog. Yo. Hey, you said I could have anything I want up here for free, right? One yeah, item? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sick, bro. All right, squeaky. How much? Uh, no. <laughs>